My hobby filmed huh? me failing to fit into my favorite jeans. <laughs> Wow, that is the best thing I've ever seen! For many years, Harry was an unsuccessful streamer. But hmm? when he accidentally filled me and my extra weight, the view skyrocketed. I struggled to lose weight my whole life and felt guilty toward Harry because of it. Your extra weight is stopping us from having children. So at least, let's make some money out of it. Harry was athletic, strong and healthy. So I believed that I was the reason we couldn't have a baby. I agreed to be in his streams. Plus, as soon as the camera turned off, Harry turned into a caring partner again. Honey, you did great. You didn't get offended by those jokes, did you? My husband's audience kept growing by the minute and demanded hmm. more and more live streams. Soon, pranking me became the main content on his blog. And Harry hmm. completely stopped caring about my feelings. <laughs> He figured that the fatter I was, the higher the ratings got. <laughs> so for the next live stream, he stuffed my clothes with foam rubber. As soon as the camera turned on, some of it fell out. And the audience got angry. But my husband just played along. Hmm. <laughs> you want a real fatty? You got her! From that day forward, Harry became obsessed with the idea of making me fatter. And created a special diet for me based on junk food. He convinced me that it was for the sake hmm. of our future. After all, we were making good money with the streams. <laughs> Still, I didn't want to risk my health even further. <laughs> so I was secretly throwing all the food away. <clears throat> Harry wasn't happy with the results. And found a brilliant solution. He decided that I had to eat on camera, non-stop, for several hours in a row. I begged him to stop, but he didn't <laughs> listen to me. We broke the record! Two million people are watching us! I broke down and turned the camera off. I can't do it anymore! Stop it or... I'll leave! But Harry wasn't scared that I would leave. He was more worried about his followers, who could become angry over the sudden end of the live stream. Leave? Where? You can't even have a baby! Hmm? I'm your only chance to have a family. Harry turned on one of his streams and let me read the comments. I feel sorry for her husband. The clumsiest and fattest woman ever. Such a wife will crush you in a bad lull. Harry was right. No one wanted to be with someone like me. So I decided that I had to lose weight. That's how I would stop the audience from bullying me. Most importantly, Harry would love me again. I started exercising at home. But my husband was against my weight loss and did everything to break me. 
Working out at home became unbearable. <laughs> So I joined the gym, without telling my husband about it. However, Harry's dreams were so popular <laughs> that people at the gym recognized me. One of the coaches started filming me and making mean jokes. I hated myself and was ready to give up. But my guilt kept me from doing it. I lose weight and finally get pregnant. I found a cheap gym on the outskirts of town. It was hard to get there. But it was the only place where no one recognized me. The coach trained me without mocking me. And soon I saw the first results. It seemed that my husband also noticed the change. As I got a sweet text from Harry for the first time in a while. Honey, where are you? Come home soon. I miss you. But I was wrong. He was being kind because I was late for his live stream. I got stuck in traffic on the way home and decided to check on Harry's live stream. I was stunned when I noticed hmm. that the viewers rapidly started leaving. No one was interested in watching my husband. Hmm. When I got home, Harry's kindness immediately vanished. Start eating fast food on camera, now! 300,000 people have unfollowed me already! But I had a different plan. I held the plate with the burger and flipped it on my husband's head. Are you out of your mind? Then I pointed at the screen. The viewers were coming back and demanded me to keep humiliating Harry. I thought he would understand everything and ask for forgiveness. But he told me not to stop. I'm popular again. Keep going. He was pathetic. I couldn't believe I had allowed such a worthless person to humiliate me. Your viewers will like this even more. I took out the test results, <gasps> which I secretly hid from my husband. Harry, you're the reason we can't have children. But I don't care anymore. We're getting a divorce. The divorce process was live-streamed. And the record of views was broken once again. Hmm? That whole experience taught me that internet bullies don't care who they mock. They just enjoy humiliating vulnerable people. Once I got out of the toxic relationship and stopped caring about what others think, I found someone who truly loves me for who I am. Don't let someone else's opinion of you become your reality.